Hey, what's up, guys? Dan here. Welcome to an Oxlade Chamberlain player review. Now, if you're looking for some cheap coins and to buy these players like these, Oxlade Chamberlain in form, then go check out utcoinsview.com. Their links will be in the description, and you can use the code MissingFurnace to get an extra 5% off. Now, this review, I don't really do reviews on my channel, but I'm thinking of starting it up. I hope you like the graphics of this series, and um, I've got this like laid out on the screen right here with the in-game stats as well. He has got the 4-star weak foot and the 4-star skirmish, which is really helpful, but unfortunately, he is in a CDM position, which I did convert him to a cam, just because he is an attacking player. He's got the 90 pace and the 86 dribbling, but the reason I did it as well is because he's got the 50 defending, so he obviously needs to be upgraded to a cam, and it was really like worthwhile. He's got 90 pace, 91 acceleration, and 89 agility, and his uh, balance is 93. Um, he is 79 rated, which isn't the highest of players, so you're paying quite a few coins for a player who's only 79 rated, and in the end, I did pay 170,000 coins, you can pick him up for around 130 to 140 now, and he actually got me 14 goals in 16 games. He didn't get me any assists, which is a bit surprising, as in one of the clips, it looks like he does get a touch on it to get a through and goal, but I really like this player, he's a really good attacking player, and he's got great dribb dribbling on him as well. He has, in fact, got, um, like some uh, medium attacking work rate and medium defensive work rate which does let him down if you're playing him in a cam he's going to be in a CDM position for quite a lot of the time I'm not sure why but he just does and look at that shot from Oxlade right there his long shots are actually really good so if you're like quite far out 35 to 40 yards then have a go at um, shooting with his right foot or left foot because he's got the four star weak foot as well and he's just really good at weaving it in and out of players right here and he does get the shot off in the end but it's a good save by the keeper and He's just a really good player, so if you could drop a like on this player review, that would be appreciated a lot. And can we hit 100 likes on this video, that would be even better. Look at this, Oxlade just dribbling in and out of players, and he's still carrying on. It's a great finish into the bottom corner, getting me, in a, getting me a goal, just to make it 2-0 to me. And he just had a great effect on his team. He was linking up with everyone, and that's a great pass through to Wilshire. And I re really like this player. I thought that he did a great job for me, and... Um, he just it's just better that he's got the four star skirmish as well just really well to get past the player then but it's a weak tame shot towards the keeper right there and he picks up on every chance he gets if he picks up the ball in the centre of the park he'll just run with it he puts um, like I'll get a great ball here and it's just a dink over the keeper and it only just trickles in and it's it's a bit unfortunate for the defender not to clear that, but it's a great finish in the end by Oxide Chamberlain. Really cheeky to do that, and um, he actually wins a like it's sort of a half volley there, and it, he was really clear in the corner box. If you shot from the edge of the box as well, he'd finish that off as well. And he's got a really nice, powerful shot with, with a really good finesse shot as well. I really advise you. Um, buying this player, especially if you use him in a cam position, or maybe even a striker position, he gets the goals and not the assists, but um, he just has a great effect on his team, and a 90 pace just breaks him away from the defender, as you can see here, and he does a great finish past the keeper into the top corner, proving to be a great clinical finisher um, he's really good in tricky situations here, he picks a ball up from a corner does a roulette and chop, and he managed to find a shot in the end, but I can't score from it but it's a great like footwork from him as well, and he's just he's quite a small player but he's got a lot of strength on him as well half the time he will like actually push off the defender and um he actually wins a few headers as well if he's in a one and one situation like with the ball in the air he will actually win quite a lot of the headers and he pushes off the defender here and like I know it's someone else sorry and but he just picks up the ball here and he goes for an effort and he hits a post he was really unlucky not to score right there and he's just a really good player to use on his team and um it's even better that he's an Arsenal player as well. To get a cam with 90 plates and 86 dribbling is really good. And his positioning is his only weak point. I found that his weak foot's really good. And he does have an active part, like doing everything in the midfield. His passing is really good. And that's what the touch was. I thought that was a touch from him to get it through to Sturridge, who does finish it off in the end. But it's a bit of a roulette pass. And it looked really good when I played with it. And also he picks the ball up in the edge of the box. And that's what he's best at. And he does hit it at the keeper. And the keeper parries it onto the post. And and I was unlucky not to score it. And um, Oxley's really good at those um, outside the box situations. He picks up the ball and the computer, no, the player wasn't playing. And I'm not sure why, but I still managed to pick it up and chip it over the keeper and finish it off in the end. And um, Sturridge picks it up here and he, he plays really well alongside Oxlade. And I do actually play him in a striker position a couple of times and it works so well. And that's Oxlade actually winning the header in the right place at the right time. 
We do get another chance here with Sturridge picking up the ball and dinks it over to Oxlade who again is in the right place at the right time. So I'm slating his positioning but in the end he does get in the right place at the right time quite a lot of the time and he does a bit of a swerve and just gets around the defender and it's a really good finish off the post. And I'm sorry for the lack of uploads this week. I had to finish off two coursework deadlines and I have finished that now so the uploads will be consistent now and I'm sorry about that like little gap but look at that finish there right into the top corner from the edge of the box. It was such a good finish and I do advise buying this player. He is 140,000 coins at the moment but when he drops he will definitely be worth the coins. And I just break away from the defence and there's no chance that the defence is going to catch up with me. And he does finish it off very well in the end and he does score quite a few good goals actually. I was surprised with how many he actually scored from the cam position. And if he picks it up here it's a nice volley into the bottom corner. And he is so good at volleys as well. And this is my final rating for him. I thought that it was a 9 out of 10 overall rating and for value for money he is 7 at the moment but if he does drop then he will definitely be worth the coins and I hope you enjoyed this player review please drop a like on it and go check out utcoinsview.com their links will be down in the description and I hope you enjoyed this video see you later in the next player review or race to rear which will be out later and so thank you for watching and enjoy your day.